Welcome back guys to another boozy review, but today I'm not reviewing something for you. Today we're going to talk about Star Wars. The newest Star Wars is coming out and uh, we were curious to see uh, how you guys watch Star Wars or show Star Wars off to someone who's never seen it before. There's a whole bunch of different ways on the internet to do it. There's a uh, chronological kind of doing the whole one, two, three, four and so on. There's production order, the way they came out, and then there's a bunch of different mismatch where they kind of get placed and switched around and some episodes are even cut. Um, but enough about what I have to say and enough about all the words that are coming out of my mouth. Let's go hit the streets and see what you guys think. All right, let's go. I'm here with Alec at Freaks and Geeks, and we're going to today ask him how he likes to watch Star Wars. Bud, what order do you like to watch Star Wars in? Uh, I think, if I have to think about it, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. And it's just because literally that's how I count. Yeah, that's. No other reason. No other reason at all. <laughs> I like that. Because I count one to six, that's how we watch it. Yeah, I mean, it makes sense. All right, guys, we'll see you at the next one. All right. Well, we talked to Alec, and we heard how he likes to watch Star Wars. Joey, how do you like to watch Star Wars? I'd say episode one on up. Same way. I mean, you could watch it in order of... It just doesn't make any sense, I, would, I guess. I, I would do one through. I mean, it makes the most logical sense, but do you actually enjoy watching episode one? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I watched it on as a kid, so it so kind of kind of makes me feel nostalgic in a way. Damn you, Lucas, and your nostalgia. <laughs> All right. Thank you so much, Joe. Yeah, I appreciate yeah, it. No All right. I'm here at the Bearded Monk with Pickle, and uh, today we're going to find out how you watch Star Wars. So what order do you actually like to watch Star Wars in? Well, you, get, you have to watch them by their release dates. Like, you can't. You can't watch them as the story flows. That's ridiculous. Because then you have to get into Jar Jar Binks. And that's just a mess. It is. Have you, have you heard of the machete method of watching it? No. What is that? So it's like using the the three movies, one, two, and three, as a flashback, but it cuts out number one. So you watch, like, you watch four, then you go to two and three, then you go to five and six. Oh, that's great. Wait, and I... Like I don't have to deal with Jar Jar. No, or? you totally cut Jar Jar out of the well, pretty much out of the picture. Oh, yeah, for yeah. The most part. yeah. Golly, that is fantastic. That makes for a great movie series. It really does. Yeah. You heard it here. It does. <laughs> Down on the floor with Ben. Well, to be honest, I watch the original trilogy four, five, and six. Then I will watch seven. Then I watch Rogue Squad, Rogue Squadron, or Rogue One. Confusing video games now. Yeah, I was gonna say I do the same thing. So you completely cut out one, two, and three. Uh, I watched the end of three. Yeah, the end of three is good. I like that. No one's mentioned seven yet. No one's rotated seven into this whole thing. I mean, seven's a good one. I don't, I don't care what anyone says. I've been watching Star Wars since I could remember, and seven is about is more in line with the original trilogy than the prequels were. All right, I'm here with Tommy, and today he's going to tell us the order he would watch Star Wars if he'd never seen it before. Well, if I, since I've you know, never seen Star Wars before, I'd really just go ahead and start with Episode 1 and go from there. But luckily they made Rogue One, which ties in Episode 3 and Episode 4, so you got to throw that one in there. And hopefully this Han Solo movie you can just watch at any time you want to when it comes out next year. Hi, guys. This is Gambit. I'm here with Adam. Viren. And the question is, if you were to show Star Wars someone for the first time, what order would you show it in? Man, that's a good question. Um, I guess I would go with four, five, six, because that's, you know, the classic way to go. And then if they're really feeling like they want to ruin their life, maybe one, two, three. <laughs> Ouch. All right. I guess I would agree, but I think, yeah, I think I heard somewhere that it also makes sense to watch, I think, one and then three beforehand to get a backstory before four five six and two is just i think they said it was just trash <laughs> that's interesting so like go one three and then go into it and skip two completely i think i think that's what i heard I might have, 
heard him wrong. Skip all of them. Skip the six. Go with seven at first. <laughs> all right, the new way to watch Star Wars is skip all of them and just watch seven. And that's it. That's, that's Star Wars. <laughs> all right, I am here with Santa, and we are going to find out how Santa would watch Star Wars if he was showing it to someone for the first time. How would you do it, Santa? With a lot of narration. <laughs> yeah, is that how you are? Yeah, that's how I am, and particularly Santa will be pointing out who's a good boy in the picture and who's a bad boy. I think that might ruin it if we start on the earlier episodes. Yeah, well, <laughs> those are rather obvious as to who's good and bad. Darth Vader is the only one in that whole set that did not get a present from Santa. Good to know. Thank you so much, Santa. You're quite welcome. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. <laughs> All right, guys. Well... That's all we got here. I love talking to everyone. I especially love talking to Santa. Who doesn't like talking to Santa? Um, and I hope you guys like this. Uh, please let us know below, comment what you like, what you don't like. If you want to see more of this kind of stuff, otherwise make sure you follow us on Facebook and Twitter and uh, join our Discord server. The info will be in the blah 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 below. All right, see you guys next time. You want to say description instead of blah blah blah? Nope, I like blah blah blah.